Let's go. We got old time Nick Peck, Connor, Jimmy Z, Big Motor, Day, and Evelyn Bob. Can of the pot fun. Uh, <laughs> I didn't hear what he said. Uh, everyone's here but Ty. Here we go, boys. Uh, Godzilla vs. Kong. Let me say first. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Let me say first. Hey, look, I we, we very clearly oh, said everyone gets to do it the way they want to. I like this is how I do it. it. Well, Mitt right was saying you sounded nervous, dude. Well, I'm not. Uh, that's why I want to get into it. I was more excited for what we're about to do. Godzilla vs. Kong is pretty good. The end, the second half of it was completely worth the uh, membership to HBO Max, which I had to start. Uh, but I, I liked it. I thought you guys undersold it. Oh uh, yeah, I don't know. I loved it. Zito wasn't here to talk it up in, in his. No, I know, and that's oh, why I love you guys. Say okay, I did not trash it. Nick okay. said it stunk. Uh, I I actually said it didn't use the word stunk on the show. I just, it was a really slow build up. Yep. First forty five minutes, first like hour, it was very slow. I, I felt like they should have got right into it. Back and then I said they ripped off Pacific Rim. I think Tony yeah. said it perfectly, right? That you know they kind of forgot that you did have a couple movies prior that set up your backstory. Yeah, and they just kind of got a little redundant and got back in there. But man, that's and they, I didn't even mind that though. They glossed over that because that's that's not what we want. No, we I want. do. Did you see it? Yeah, I watched it last night, and it was awesome. I was disappointed. No, oh, wow. oh, what? Tony. Why? Tony. I know why Tony's disappointed, and I completely agree with him. It's too much Kong, not enough fucking Zilla, dude. That's I mean, fair. they and they also seemed like they rushed everything. It was oh, wait, wait, wait. We, we have to say no spoiler. Spoiler, 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 spoiler. Now go. Spoiler, no, spoiler. Yeah. No, no, you're you're spoiler. It's been out for. It's been out for. I know, but people get mad. We got too say long. It. It's been out for a week. Yeah, that, and a week in a pandemic is like a year. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. It felt like they rushed things. Like they didn't even fucking Millie Bobby Brown didn't even have a fucking chance to marinate before she was getting attacked on screen. Mm. Coach. Coach didn't get enough time. Yeah, but True. Spider-Man Z was in it. Spider yeah. Deadpool Z, get it right if you're going to uh, say Deadpool Z, Deadpool. you're right. It was yeah. Deadpool Z. Uh, if you're Deadpool gonna say 2 it, Z, if true. we're being... If you're going to fucking say it. Deadpool <laughs> 2 tap, Z. Tap water Z, go ahead, drop tap the joke. Z. And this is going to sound oh, weird, but I thought this the entire time. Feels like normally Godzilla's got a little bit of a personality. They didn't show his personality very much in this one. No, no, no. no. All Kong's personality. No, they Kong. showed it. He wants to be the best and want to protect the world. That's that's Well, I will him. say this. I did, a hero. I did um, feel pretty good in my midsection when fucking Zilla had a fucking foot on Kong's chest and could have ended his life. And it was over. Yeah. And we yeah. knew yeah. who the real King of the Monsters was. I don't know about Kong. that. What do you mean? I don't know. Kong, dude. It was over. Godzilla won right there. Guy had to have a fucking Las Vegas jump starter to his heart, dude. Plus, God, when dude. Godzilla was clawing his ass, he was fucking him up. I yeah. never saw really where Godzilla, aside from using his hammer axe and chopping him in the leg. That's what I mean. Godzilla himself it. was He didn't go to his biggest ass. strength. He had that axe. Zilla looked just, pretty He, he hit him in the head with it one Very time. true. Yeah. Zilla looked no, pretty agile, actually. In the movie. Was, he did. He was moving. I thought the fight scenes like of them in the city were awesome. Yeah. yeah. I mean, um, I'll be honest. I actually fast forward through most of the movie. I only no. stopped to watch oh, some of that. I only stopped to watch when you they were actually saw the awesome part. Uh, yeah, son of a bitch. I only saw the awesome part. Don't know how, what was calling Also, them. the build-up for Mega was not enough either. They just showed him, and then, like, two minutes later, he was at. Also, I thought uh, after the robot dinosaur story died. story stunk. I will say the story stunk. Yeah, the story wasn't good. I thought the robot dinosaur was some fake, like, bitch thing, and then the real Mega Godzilla yeah. was going to come out after. Turns oh, out, really? Turns out the robot <laughs> They could have made him look Godzilla. cooler. Yeah, absolutely. I was I like how you predicted the plot last episode to the the next movie in your mind, and it was actually the final act of this yeah. movie. Yeah, and it, to be honest, that was the first act to this movie because that's really the only thing. And I saw. let's let's mention that uh, Godzilla could not defeat the robot by himself. He needed 
Well, that's true. That's true. Needed, after well, it's because it was yeah. mega yes. him, dude. Remember he did this? It was awesome that uh, King Kong turned into Captain America was fucking jumping all across the tops of buildings. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Shout, out. Shout out to the engineers. Shout players. out to the hard workers of yeah. Tokyo because that city has been absolutely Man. devastated. It's been through it. Many, many times. Yeah. Just like every building in the entire city. I didn't like uh, Sirizawa's scumbag son. Oh, yeah. Who controlled Mega Godzilla? Wait, Sirizawa's son was... I mean, Tom, that's who man. controlled Mega Godzilla. Did we oh, even watch the same movie? Did you even watch, that, bro? Was it? Yeah. Yeah. See, I, I skipped I, everything. I, I still <laughs> knew that. I mean, I watched the entire movie intently, and I didn't... Sirizawa's son would never do that. Well, he did. Yeah. And they, they kind well, of say fucking... through that his brain was being taken over by that fucking thing. What thing? The, what, what was Skull was he in? The, the power from the... Uh, like, yeah, it was taking over from fucking... King fucking Gidra. with Yeah, taking it was like over, man. when Megatron took over in the one yeah. Transformers movie. Yeah. Ghidra mm -hmm. took over his fucking brain, dude. Ghidra. I thought it was pretty good, though. I don't it's know really where it's movie. going. That's what I said to Mint I on like my way story. out. See, I'm a, I, also, I like the action of Godzilla, yeah. but I also love the story of Godzilla. So where is it going, then? Are we doing again? Well, How's Kong get his own movie? Kong's an upside Don. I think they need to go back to where they bring all. Them. I love a good all the mon where all the monsters. They burn that out. card already. Though. I know. They use them all they in one the movie. Fuck but yeah, now they're all still out it. there. Yeah, and now they can do it in the upside down. I guess you're right. They didn't really kill any of them, huh? No, no, just, 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 just Ghidra. Mothra's still out there fucking flying around. Hydra. How how Ghidra die? Was that early in the movie? King or was Ghidra that last was movie? the three headed. Yeah, that was oh, the one before. Shit. That was King of the Monsters. That was definitely going into. That's when fucking Godzilla went supernova. Yeah, that was sweet. What was the monster like? Mexico was like the the was it was that King Mantra? El Toro. The one that flew out of the volcano, volcano, yeah. Rodan. Rodan. Wow. Once upon a time in Mexico. I mean, I just watched this movie to get in the right frame of mind for the next one. Which one did you like? Fresh in my mind. Oh, to be honest, I might have liked. I like King of Monsters more. Yeah, me too. Well, because there's more monsters. Well, yeah. also, I, I like the story. I like the story. I like learning about the backstory. See, I thought Kong, I thought the. F I wish they would have done most a recent Kong one was. Kong. And of course, the Skull epic Island. tie's not here, but. Oh, there it is. Long live the king. Yeah. I, I wish they would have the done king. a flashback to Kong's family running the uh, uh, upside down world. Yeah, yeah, I thought we'd get yeah. a, like a, uh, a yeah. shot of some other Kongs. So, at some I mean, point. it was an hour so and maybe 50. That's what I thought we're it was doing. an hour and 50 runtime. Like, it could have been 2 30. Yeah. I wanted Kong's mother in it. Yeah, I wanted some of that. So maybe that's like, what's next, though. Maybe they're going yeah. back. The axe was made out of one of Godzilla's parents' Th spinal cords. That was pretty cool. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Also, show me the little girl's parents dying in an attack. Jesus. The one who could communicate with Godzilla? Yeah. She was cool. I did watch one scene where she was... She was sweet. Be careful. Fucking, uh, the bad guy's daughter was bitch. Bill's yeah. been waiting to say something for like 20 fucking Okay, well, it's Bill. Hey, I gotta get out of here, guys. Hey, you guys have a great show, okay? Oh, no, 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 no. I did see, though. You gotta you come gotta, in here. You, gotta you don't get off that easy. You tweeted. Yeah. You, don't you get said you were in there. You, and you did you promise this. You don't get backroom camera, oh, dude. Come on in. Now, get, get the camera zoomed in. Come on right in front of that thing, Bill. Put him right under those fucking lights. Bill made a change yesterday. He uh, they, he prequeled yes. it on the uh, on his own Instagram story at Bill. Keep McComas. walking, pal. Come on, on Bill. Right right under, under, you know it's under the bright lights, oh, my friend. You know where to go. Right, right there. The two yeah. Of us. Yeah. No, no, look left. Look left. There it is. Right here. Oh my God. Oh my God. Do a spin. Wow. Do a spin. Yeah, that's nice. That's that's looking good. good. Oh, yeah. Bill is bald. Bill, that is not coming back, my friend. I wish I could make funny, Bill, but you look twenty times yeah. better. You yeah. look good. Yeah, the little uh, quaff that I had going on up top wasn't really lasting much longer. Yeah, well, fair enough. Good. Are you going to grow out Gumpy's beard now, though? I don't think I could do that, but I might do like how we were talking about Gumpy getting a hair piece put on. Like yeah. I yeah. might just stay bald and get a beard piece put on. Don't Ooh, shave. Ooh, yeah. Oh, if you find a good yeah, one, don't shave. Right don't <laughs> let it ride. Don't <laughs> shave. Let it go. Yeah. You look I'm just done with it. You look it, tough. You look bad. If I ever go get like hair therapy, like I can get it done from here and then it'll grow from there, but Oh, yeah. I love that. Hell yeah. There you go. Or How do the it. How old are you? Uh twenty four, Tony. Oh, you're an asshole, Tony. I was just wondering, I was just <laughs> nah, I know what he's doing. Nah, Tom, we all know what he's doing. I have, have hair issues too. Yeah. I, I, we all do everybody in this room and well, but, you know, you get chirped when you're thirty five, it's a little bit different than when you're twenty four. I mean man, sir, he's got the quick, fucking like, health on his head. Yeah, I've got I've got the Mike's fucking the I've got the, I've got the lettuce shit. upstairs. Yeah. yeah, I mean I can't grow if I can't grow a complete beard. Half Afghan, half Puerto Rican, and my beard yeah. trims off like a thirteen year old member of Al Qaeda. So Zeet's next. No, yeah, I am, but uh, I'm going to go see Hair Jordan. 
Oh, so you you won't do the uh, Bill? You look good. Bill, Bill you look good, dude. Look good, Bill. Look good, Bill. Out of baby, Bill. Not doing that. Z, no, do it. Now. Go for the close crop shave, Z. I thought about it, dude. I can't grow a good beard. I so want Z I'm... to get the LeBron like line again. I did. I did have yeah, it. Yeah, bring it back. Yeah, you should do that again. But you know what? It sucked though. Barber you can't Mike. wear hats anymore. Yeah, Mike, balance, balance the barber. Yeah, Why you can't. You not you'll need barber. to wear hats when you got that, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I destroyed the one hat. It was just ink everywhere. I felt like a squid <laughs> jumped in there. Yeah, you can't put it on immediately after. You gotta wait like it's like paint, right? Well, no, that was like a day after, dude. Yeah, okay, it's, so it's no matter what. Yeah, you probably you get a, you get a good sweat. Awesome you should see my that. pillow. Yeah. My Did pillow they, was even worse. Yeah, hey. they use the powder stuff. <laughs> no, it was it was, uh, no, it was no, it was like a a spray gun. <laughs> it's like right? oil. Yeah, it was oh, like, like a spray tan gun. <laughs> yeah, that's what it was. You yeah. would airbrush your head. That's what it was. Yeah, it was airbrush. That's awesome. What's that meant? They just taped you off, see? Like yeah, you can't. Yeah. So you can get like uh, they put it as like yeah, it looked like Boozer. Line. You put hair, you put like powder in there, and then they hairspray it on so it sticks. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Mate, what about you? Is there is there baldness in your future? Doesn't look no, you got, no, you got a good flow up there. No, my uh, my dad has a full head of hair, are, yeah. and my Jesus. mom does. Yeah. Good lord. I got, I got a lot of hair actually. <laughs> yeah, it fucking clogs the yeah. sink every week. Crazy. Dude, I've been growing. I've been. Are you guys shit. living together again? Uh, and Gump, no. No, no just, Gumpy has oh, a yeah, awesome. fantastic yeah, 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 house downtown. He's hey, living hard. Yeah, I still gotta, see, I gotta go see the fucking Gump Plaza. Hey, we mm -hmm. are living now, boys. <laughs> oh, yeah. Actually, probably a good idea, Gump. You need to take some advice from the listeners. If you guys could tweet Gumpy and tell him some things to get into his apartment spice oh, up. Yeah. I walked in that place, it looked like a serial killer. Yeah. Oh, empty? Was, yeah. I tried to give him my couch. Rustin Cole from... Hey, he's living Jack. like Rustin Cole, exactly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Zito nah, opened man. up the utensil drawer. Yeah. There was one... Uh, fork. I keep them. I keep them in, in the bucket. Yeah, oh, we got you a welcoming yeah, packet when you first got here. Yeah. yeah, I mean, hey, at least hey, Mike got me a fucking something. welcoming gift. Don't nice. worry, I got you. I got something coming for you. What'd you get him? Oh put God. together a nice little package of just like, oh. you know, everyday housewares. Well, I would give them something. I, I tried giving them fucking about 20 of my nicest plates. Some of my fucking... What happened? Fine China. Well, I, I, I got you, for my wedding. You, you, know, gave, you, you gave me that box when you had... That's your, not true. You had COVID, so... Not true. <laughs> <laughs> he gave you COVID <laughs> plates. I was letting the box air out. <laughs> and I haven't taken them home yet. In my defense, I don't have one, but... I did give you some yeah, sweet plates, defense. and they have been sitting out in the office since yeah. I gave them to them. So are those free to go? Since December. Yeah. You, if the oh, company doesn't want them, you can have them. Wait, those aren't the disposable couple. plates that built No, 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 no. Right? These are real fucking, <laughs> real sweet plates that were replaced by some fine china that was purchased for the wedding. I will yeah. take them home one day, Tony. Thank I, you. I just... Because it's I'm insulting at this point. Realistically, I have I'm no use for them, if we're being honest. So what do you have in your apartment at the moment, then? Just like a chair? TVs? No, just got, a couch? I got a couch. It's got the Viking. The Viking. It's got a couch, a rug, and a TV, and that is it. Yeah, yeah. What else do you full, need, dude? A full bedroom with a walk-in closet. Listen, I, I uh, yeah, appreciate cool. the minimalist lifestyle as well, but like, <laughs> put something on the wall. Yeah. Put yeah. something on the countertop. Just one, like a, just, just something. A the Fenway picture or something? Don't yeah, you I do. I just haven't hung it. It's sitting in the bedroom. Okay. Oh, there you go. We went into the bedroom. That's what. But the one thing that got me was uh, Chick-fil-A sauces. You had so many of them in your fridge. Mm. I and that's mean, a power move. Yeah, you have to. That's, that's a great condom. It goes with anything, right? Yeah. yeah. You can use that for homemade sandwiches. Not that I'm doing that, but... Make your own check for it. Well, either way, Bill looks good bald. I was going to put, like, 18 bald dudes <laughs> in the pod pod and just pick which one he looked like, but I was like, eh, fuck it, I don't want to... Can I uh, bring That's not up? what this is about. Go ahead, of course. Uh, so, Mitt, what do you call uh, Mike? Uh, Mr. Mansuri. And nothing else? I, yeah, I, I kind of just have always... He's always called yeah. me by my Instagram name. I All like right. it. I, he, he said it once, and I was like, oh, that's weird. And then he kept doing it. I was like, oh. Why do you call him Mr. Mansuri, though? Uh, I don't know. I just kind of did it the first Man time. He might actually then, just call everybody by their social media names, now that I think about it. Is that it. what it is? He might. Actually. He always calls me Bubba Gumpino. That is just so Brown true. also Brown also calls you Bubba yeah. all the time. Isn't Mitt's like Hollywood Mitt or something? Yeah, like Money Mitt. Yeah, Money, Money, Mitt. Mitt. Money No, Mitt. no, at some point it was Hollywood or something like that, wasn't it? No, Rockstar. my Instagram name is still Rockstar. 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 He used to call yeah. Nick Meraldo 412. <laughs> really? I tried to get Nick Meraldo on Instagram. The guy won't give it up. I think more people who use it, Nick. Uh, it's another Nick Meraldo who <laughs> does not check his DMs and doesn't have an active account. Well, I mean, why don't you do on. Frank? Well, then I got to change the Twitter name. True. Yeah. You gotta change everything. You said yeah, bald can't, bill. Can't do that. You gotta wake up at a different time. Wait, yeah, we gotta change. We gotta change. <laughs> you gotta be a whole new guy. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta change Bailey's social handles now. Bald bill. 
bald. He's Bill. bald, Bill. Double B. Bald Bill. I, bald Bill. I do wonder if uh, he's gonna like that name or not. But <laughs> since he's not here to defend himself, Zito, if you can call it up, I th- you know what? I, this just kind of dawned on me. Uh, Bailey now kind of looks like Bald Bull from the old Mike Tyson's Punch Out game with that oh. head. Oh man, I would love to have a guy that we could call Bull around here. <laughs> yeah, we should just call him Bull. Bailey. Yeah, can be our Bull. Bull. Bull, bull. bull McComas. I mean, Bill's not even his real name, so we can call <laughs> there him. There it is, dude. <laughs> Ball, ball. <laughs> oh my god, he does have that. Uh, He's got that head. Yeah, he does. Uh, See, this is what I was gonna do with the bald people, but we kind of crossed off this entire game. There's a just cartoon this character one. that looks just like him that I couldn't think of. Today. There's a few, I mean, but hey, look, that's not what this is about. Uh, does anybody else have anything to get off their chest? I watched uh, mm. Billion Dollar Boys Club. What's Anybody that? seen that before? What's no, that good? I hope that's not. It's a movie. Show. Okay, uh, it is pretty terrible. Uh, <laughs> Kevin Spacey's in it. No. Oh. oh. Yeah, so there you go. New movie? Yeah, no, it's, it's 2018. Working, huh? It was with uh, that Ansel Egg, Egghorn oh. kid. Uh, and then, Eggie. Uh, Egg, Eggie Egerton? And Taron Egerton, yeah. Those oh, two. he was just in it. Yeah, it was those two guys. Those were the three main characters. It was all right. It's based on a true story. That's what got me. So I gave it a run, uh, but I would not recommend it. What's right. it about? It's about these, these kids who just scheme their way to the top. It's like a Jordan Belfort, honestly, but on the West Coast. Sounds like 21. West Coast Kind of like 21, except they were just unbelievable at gambling. What? The West Coast that Pink Sheets. If you're talking yeah, fucking basically. Jordan Belfort and the boys. What was the uh, casting director like? Just get me everyone who's ever uh, sexually assaulted somebody. I want to put them in. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Basically. Wait, Eggie has, wow. has two? Not uh, him. Taron the, uh, the Ansel guy. Huh? Ansel did too? Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah he Ansel, got canceled? An- Ansel's guilty. Yeah. When? Ansel, he was so hot that back then. Yeah, after the fall. Yeah, of the he stars, hasn't been in anything recently, has he? He was big. You, no. Elgort, Ansel, El- Ansel Elgort. Yeah, that's a kid. He's a kid. Oh, oh he's this kid guy. Anymore. Yeah, yeah, that guy. Oh, Baby Driver. Uh huh. Yeah, there you go. Oh, that guy got he ain't canceled. Driving no more. Yeah, that guy. Was Baby Driver good? I didn't mind Baby I didn't Driver. Mind it. Yeah, it was entertaining. John Hamm, Jamie Foxx, good music. J H. Jay. It's always sweet when Ham puts his penis on the table, which he did do. Oh, yeah. A couple times during that movie, too. Yeah. So, like, if that happens, yeah, it's a good movie. But no, that's all I got. What'd you guys do? Anything good? <laughs> oh, I started uh, I go. started watching a TV show, Outer Banks. Not that yeah, good. Man. Yeah, man. Oh, man, they just finished filming season two, I think. Did they really? Okay, well, it's good enough for me to keep watching, which was something. But, uh, I mean, I don't know. The last the... episode, how the last episode ends is fucking terrible. But Oh, sweet. So I'm probably not going to keep watching this. No, thing. no, you yeah, should. It's right call. up your alley. You're like, you're a, uh, I don't want to say anything derogatory. So you're one of, the, you're a pogue? Yeah, you're a clown. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess I kind of didn't really see myself on either side of that spectrum, but yeah. No, you were definitely with the rich, mean kids. I did not think that, but yeah, I mean, I don't know. I watched, and I felt like a stooge because I'd never watched any of his previous, Eric Andre's movie on Netflix, The Mm. Bad Trip, I think it's called. I heard you guys talking about that. Hysterical. Really? Like, I was like, this guy is an evil genius. I could just the never get into The situation she puts people in. Ah, yeah, I could. I always had trouble getting into his shit, but you guys spoke about it very, very highly this So week. I never watched his show, but anytime I saw a clip of him on Twitter, I would laugh and be like, yeah. oh, that guy's over the top. The movie He's was. He's got the let me in clip. It's, I mean, the la- it's the first time I've like laughed out loud watching something really? genuinely in a while. Yeah. He just, this, it was like a, a Borat type of like bad grandpa type of prank movie yeah, with a yeah. linear story going throughout it and it's basically turning all the random people into extras in a movie they don't know they're in just watching their reactions to the wild shit he was doing is outstanding see i watched the trailer and i thought that was like one of those movies where you watch the trailer and then you watch the movie like everything on there is what you see what you see is what you get no the the now the trailer is a nice uh tease as to what's in there Hook. but he go he goes next level with some of the shit okay mm. i wasn't sure Maybe I'll give it a run. I like the fact that you said that, you know, you and the miss is probably watching it at home. If you were laughing about it in a, just the two of you, like to me, that's always kind of the test, right? Like I call it the Anchorman theory. You go see Anchorman in the theaters, fucking everyone's laughing their heads off and you're having uh-huh. a good time. You watch it by yourself at home. Not as funny as you found it. In Bingo. The it was also because cool like I didn't have any expectation because yeah. like I didn't know. I didn't watch a show like Zito. I think we we're talking about it. Zito had watched his show. He said he got burnt out on him because I could see how that yeah. could happen. Because like he's a lot. Yeah. Who, Andre? Yeah. Yeah, I got burned out. These things. Zeke got burned out? No, it's just, if it, like, the stick, it's a very funny stick, but, like, if you watch it nonstop behind, I haven't seen this movie yet, but 
I, I heard the movie's really good, but uh, I, I don't know. It's just like the jokes. His jokes are like very heavy on the old mind. <laughs> heavy. They make you say. think a lot. Not really. <laughs> Not exactly how I would describe it, but <laughs> no, so just, light on the old mind. I was a lot of slapstick, really. make you just dumb laugh, but it was. I'm not good. gonna say it's cringe humor. I guess it is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. oh yeah. So yeah, you get too much of that. Like there was, I, I think he was uh, interviewing <laughs> Dennis Rodman, and the couch started eating things. That could get heavy. Oh, that is mind. heavy mind yeah. humor. That could. <laughs> oh, I know. That yeah, could crush me. I think John Cena broke a couple of Eric Andre's ribs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fucking like heavy mind. Cena was in it? Yeah, and this, I don't know if it was for the movie, but I know he and Cena, Eric Andre and Cena, did something together, and I think Cena cracked a couple of Eric's ribs. Oh, put, really? put him down. I mean, really? I just love that clip of him. It, you know what it reminded about. me of? It reminded me of Tom Green. Yeah. Back in the day. Uh, like the Tom Green show and the stuff he used to pull. It, very, mm -hmm. it reminded me of that. And it just, it took me to, it took me to a warm place and, I, and laughed. It's like oh, Between so Two Ferns. So there's a oh, little I nostalgia. like Between Two Ferns. That's yeah. what grabbed you. The nostalgic of it. The nostalgia. Whoa. Wow. Wow. <laughs> How's that feel? Let's get into the fun. Oh, no. <laughs> Let's get into the fun. Thanks, Mitt. Uh, someone sent in a bunch of seltzers. I meant to remember their name, but I already forgot it. Uh, Bud Light Seltzer. I've never had that one. I've never it's had right. the platform. Have you guys had all these? What's they the were hydro, asking dude? if you I, can keep two. Which two are you keeping is what the question so was. So if we're keeping two, I mean, we know. Press? I've never going, had half We know these. we're going Mango uh, Claws. Mm -hmm. For sure, for me. I'm keeping claws. I mean, did the person. The Natty Light ones are actually pretty fucking. I had really one that are good. In, on vacation I'd never heard of before. Funky Buddha. Funky, Funky Buddha Seltzer. It was delicious. Butler. Really? Very good. <laughs> Is that only down there, though? Is that a Florida <laughs> base? I don't know. I don't know <laughs> if it was local or what, but. Okay. I, um. Was talking to a couple down on vacation. They said all their, like, their local breweries yeah. are now also creating local. Seltzer drink. So the, when I went home to Mass, there was like three or four different I seltzers that. that were just there. There was like Razu or something like that. It was unbelievable. Razu. Razu. Yeah, some, yeah, yeah, and they had like a cool can. I always thought the Corona ones were the second best. Me too. The yeah. I, I, never had good. I hate yeah. the Corona ones, mm. dude. Those are horrible. The best one on here is the Izzy's one. I actually will buy those all the time. And the classic White Claw, new flavor, fucking great. What, I mean, one new flavor. Oh, a lot of new flavors. Oh, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, I'm not gonna try them. So. Uh, I oh, just, you got. I should really. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah, like sell them in twenty-four tea. ounce that I can carry out of a yeah, brown paper bag. Yeah, probably. Good point. I don't know. Has anyone had have. the iced tea? I've had the iced tea. It's pretty good. It's There's like raspberry peach, iced tea, peach, too. mango, raspberry. Is that raspberry? the black can? No, I haven't seen the black can. Are these platinums? Yeah, those are Bud Light Platinum Seltzers, right? What? Yeah, I've had those. They're intense. Oh. That's a whole nother level. Oh, so of rock yeah. That's a whole nother level of booze. You what remember when high? Platinum's got big? Mm -hmm. oh, oh, yeah. Be on them? Oh, yeah. What's the, the alcohol? Oh, wait, wait, there's Platinum those. fucking Celsius? Yeah. yeah, that's what we're talking about, Tom. Dude, I'm in, dude. Well, I was trying to look up <laughs> Lemonade Black. Mike's Hard <laughs> Seltzers? Is that what that is as well next to it? Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, those are the OG. Oh, they, 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 I used to steal those Mike's from my heart. mom's fridge. Oh, oh so the, the black hands are the truly lemonades and stuff. Come on. Oh, those are good. Uh, those stink. Okay. Whoa. Oh, that's all right now, though. Bud Light uh, Limes ones Man. makes you very good at Call of Duty. Bud Light Lime oh, Seltzers. Yeah. Saw you fucking tweeting about that. Dropped 20 kills the other day in Warzone. Man, yeah. yeah. You were hammered, dude? Yeah, you were taking those it down the other day. Huh? I was sipping on a Bud Light Lime. Those are heavy, Z. I love a good Bud Light Lime. Oh, yeah. I don't know why. When that first came out, that was just just a refreshing treat. Oh, you yeah. You ever the Lime Aritas? Yeah. Uh huh. Couple of those, though, and you're, yeah, you're out right. for the count. Yeah. Too much you're sugar. Wrong. We're calling it a night. Yeah. It used to be for me when it got nice out. It was like, all right, let's get a case of Limes. Yes. And let's just sit outside for a little bit. Just have a time. That just moved into Coronas. Now I just like. Can I bring something up about Coronas? You know? What's that? What you got? Those margaritas, they put a Corona in there. Are those good? Like a beer with like, like yeah. margaritas? I think down? so. Yeah. You should have the Yinzerita with the Icy Light. Oh, yeah. Come dude. on. Yeah. You ain't ready for Yenzerita. that. Yenzerita. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yenzerita. They yeah. fucking, it's the uh, it's frozen marg. Yeah. When they fucking put an icy light mango, I think, actually. And it's Ooh. fucking delicious. Tasty. I mean, for that. It just right. tastes like beer, though. No, it doesn't. Oh, dude, it's a margarita. No, yeah. Not You've any. never had a margarita, like, at your house and then just poured a little Corona in it? No. It doesn't really I change just, it. I just tequila and margarita mix. What was that thing we made in college, though? That had Jello like juice. An, yeah, it had like a, an entire case of beer and then also liquors and stay away from that too. Jungle juice stuff. usually, right? Jungle juice, yeah. yeah. Okay. I use candy away. in there. Candy. Yeah, you oh, can like and throw like it up. Skittles. Skittles and stuff you hit the Gatorade yeah. thing like a pinata. Throw a Skittle yeah. in your Zima. No, 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 no. Like it makes <laughs> no, no, it no, no. Don't throw. It. Hmm. 
Oh, so you don't put Skittles in anything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's, fucking, that's why I have diabetes now. Thanks, Tony. Yeah, Tony did give Zito diabetes. Well, you didn't have to keep refilling it, Zito. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Skittle water. Sugar water. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next. Good next, by the way. Thanks, dude. Uh, I practiced it in the bathroom before we came in here. Elon Musk is Neuralink <laughs> partner in quotes, we could probably build Jurassic Park if we wanted to. Yeah, let's do this so we can see those bitch-ass dinosaurs walking around. Do it, Elon. Oh. Fucking don't talk about it, be about it. I can't wait to kick a fucking T-Rex in the moth and ship it to fucking the moon. No, Z, <laughs> Z, I actually read this. They will not be uh, taking the DNA from the dinosaurs, so they're going to make them however they want, so they actually will be big. Oh, there you go. They, they, they will be big uh, anyways. Zan, back at it again. I read it too, and there wasn't the vibe you got, like... It, they made it sound like, yeah, these dinosaurs will probably be a little fucked up and not what you're used to, but we can change them. Yeah, yeah it was just really what you mean? weird, dude. Oh, so we're doing like the um, the Chris Pratt dinosaurs. Yeah. Kind of. You're the way it sounds. Not the Dr. Grant dinosaurs. The no, way yeah. it was written, it made it sound like they were going to be like, like missing build your a few own dinosaur. brain cells. Mid dinosaurs. Like, UIOD. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I, then, like, it also <laughs> said that they would get, like, they would, like, Basically, uh, what's the word? Evolve, like evolution type stuff into like their. <laughs> uh, the own. word is nostalgic. <laughs> uh, after a few generations, Go they'll work their kinks out. Yeah, like it's it is creepy as. The hell. internet's soft though because I said fucking do it, Elon. They're like, oh, did you not see the movies? All right, dude, those are movies. It's gonna yeah. be fine if we do it in real life. There's called fences, okay? Uh, Listen, I'll we put know my what foot not down. to do now. Yeah. yeah, just don't jump in the cage. See, I think you just put them underground in that massive tunnel that he's trying to build, and then we just see how they work down there. If they don't work down there, they're not going to work. Well, they're going to eat all the tunnel people. You, tunnel people. You got to keep them aside. You didn't know that there's an entire city underneath of Las Vegas, huh? Like the Matrix. Yeah, it's Atlantis. No, no, like tunnel people. Oh, there's actually people. Oh, it's, like, oh, yeah. it's like demolition, man. Yeah. Really Do you is. know about this, right? The mole men. There's a mole. There's, Wait, mole men there's really? an entire city under yeah. Vegas. It's Dude, like no it's, way. homeless people just live people. under Vegas. Jeez. It is homeless people, though. It's not like a cool city. No, it's tunnel people. They're not homeless people. Well, they have homes. They're, they're tunnel people. Yeah, the yeah. They're the built tunnel. inside the tunnel. We know how you feel about homeless people, dude. Yeah, Mitt, calm down. Yeah, we don't want to get y'all riled up. Dude. Yeah. Oh, they're always asking me for a dollar. <laughs> That's a one. There's, so there's, a, card. there's a thousand people living in the tunnels underneath there. Jeez. Yeah. Really, uh, they just lose all their money, and then they were just like, well, we can't get home. We're just staying here. Cruel mistress. I don't know. I'm friend. looking at their bedrooms right now. They're pretty fucking sweet. Oh, really? Yeah, some of the tunnels are actually really, really cool, but you're not supposed to say that. I love Vegas. <laughs> Why aren't you supposed to say that? Because it's supposed to be, like, sad, but they're pretty happy down there. I assume the claw oh. machine gets down in Vegas. Oh, yeah. Buddy. That's a can of worms to open, my friend. <laughs> well, well, go ahead. Please, go ahead. We open worms here. Uh, how many times have you been there and when? Twice. In the tunnels? First time I went with my uh, lady. Uh, Second time. Just went to shows and stuff. Second time was That's for what trip. we call a stag. You guys call it bachelor party. Yeah. A, you call it a I stag? I wish we called it stag. Stag. Cool. stag do, yeah. do, do they, do in, they put, in England, it's called a stag do. Yeah, do you call them, a, do they call them hen do's yeah, the in Canada for the women? No, I That's don't what know. they call them in England. It's a hen do and a stag do. Yeah, so stag. So we had the, uh, we had the penthouse at the MGM Grand. What's up? Ooh, Gumpy. And it was very expensive, but my God, it was a fucking time, dude. That's Did you have a That's that was awesome. a dentist that put on his credit card? It's the best. No. Did you go to the Midnight Ballet? <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Midnight Ballet came to go. I was going to uh -huh. say something else there, but yeah. Yeah, we did. So are they going to build this Jurassic Park in Vegas then? Out Probably. there where everyone's the going to go see? Pal, I once had to wash the dishes at the Midnight Ballet to get out of there. <laughs> Did you really? What? <laughs> what? What was this? So you know you're in Vegas, okay? Okay, okay. This is you in Vegas then, okay? This is me in Vegas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, during the day, you're taking cash out from the ATM. Of course. Yep. Gambling. You're winning money, you're mm -hmm. losing money, you're losing money, you're losing money. You need to take more money out. <laughs> Some yeah, people's limit. ATM cards have a limit. Okay. Oh, yeah. We go to the adult ballet. Naturally. Um, go to pay at the end. Credit cards aren't working because you're in Vegas and you didn't forgot to call your credit card company. Mm. Don't mm. worry, boys. It's on me. I, to care <laughs> I got one. this one. Huh? Can't take cash out because you've already reached your limit for the day. Oh, no. Oh, God, so you're going to wash a couple dishes so the bouncer lets you out of the place. Oh, God, Tony. 
they had to. They really made you stay and wash dishes. No, my actually, my friend, my buddy bailed me out. But, I mean, I was getting worried there for a few minutes. You're rolling up the sleeves on the old button, <laughs> yeah, getting ready to go scrub a couple plates. I would have danced for it if I had to. Oh uh, yeah, I also think wash dishes is a euphemism for beat your fucking head in out back. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Fair. I figured they would have made you the bar back. What's or the something. outdoor that's club more of a cautionary. encore? Uh, no, it's Dre's Beach Club. <laughs> No, I think I went to one called Encore. Encore yeah, is, is uh, Encore Beach Club is one yeah. as well. That was the one. We were getting those Magnum bottles of fucking Grey Goose. Ooh. And like a roped off, I mean. The ones was, that come with the lights? Nick oh, and I were at Dre's and our one buddy was in a three-piece suit and four, <laughs> four foot of water in the pool. What? In the pool, oh. living, living his best life. <laughs> you, you they don't can, cover the pool at night. They just let you walk right in if you want wearing a three-piece suit. How much is like bottle service in Vegas? Oh my God! Ours like uh, was, like nine hundred dollars a bottle. Yeah, our tab was eight grand for the night. Yeah, so this is nothing like Tiki Bob's. <laughs> no, 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 nothing no, like Tiki Bob's. I don't think so. <laughs> what the well, what you do is what I did downtown. for our trip. If you book ahead of time, like if you get the VIPs and stuff ahead of time, it's more like four or five hundred bucks a bottle, and you okay. split it with like ten dudes. And okay. so it's not that bad. Oh, it's, it's eighty bucks. Well, it's ten dudes drinking a bottle, so you get like a drink or two. Sounds like you also have to plan it like a year in advance. So you don't mm -hmm. have to pay nine hundred bucks. You call VIP bottle. service. So like in my head though, so if I have you who booked it ten months ago, and then this guy that's about to spend like eight thousand dollars, I am sitting you right down to the pit every time because it's the cheaper table. Yeah, I'm I'm taking the the more money. I'm gonna say yeah, we lost your reservation, Gumpy. Come on up here. They do treat you well, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even you, ten months ahead. Yeah, they treat you well either way. Like you find people, like someone. <laughs> no. Will, like you'll meet people down there who are whatever. The bottle Every, service everyone people don't know. Promoter. That, yeah, yeah. Everyone's you'll meet the promoters promoter. down there. The bottle service it. people don't know that you booked ahead. It's your you book it with like a VIP company, and then they. Oh, get you in. so you gotta uh, let the people know, like, hey, we booked this ahead by the way. It's also kind of awkward too, because then they run you up to the door, and you're like, yeah. Oh, I thought we were just getting right in. This guy's got to talk to this guy, and he's got to say, yeah. hey, I booked this. You do skip. The line most of the time, yeah. It's nice. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> kind of. As dudes, the Vegas dudes. as dudes without money, you have to plan a Vegas trip much different than women or people with money. True. Because women drink for free naturally when they go down there is what you're saying. Whoa. They okay. just that's true, Z. So I've been there a handful of times. I went, I went there with Tony the one time where he planned everything, and it yeah. was very nice. And we've been there with Pat where mm -hmm. it's completely different and nothing is planned. Yeah. But he just greases everybody so it works out. Yeah. But, like, the first time you go, it's Sweet. cool to go with, like, your lady and just see a few shows, kind of scope it out, and then the second time, fucking let it eat. Rip it. Yeah, to Nick's point, though, it is fun to go there with, you know, with people that are uh, in the public eye yeah. because it's a completely different experience. Oh, yes. yeah. Lines don't exist. No. You find yourself in the most just fucking random situations mm -hmm. amongst the most <laughs> random groups of people. It, 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 God, you can't even put words to it. <laughs> Mike, whose ass were you doing a blow off <laughs> of in Vegas? <laughs> so I went with a bunch of buddies from WWE for, yeah. the, for the Conor McGregor fight in January oh, of last year. Oh my Conor God. and Cowboy. And we met one of the guys uh carl anderson who wrestles one of the good brothers it was his 40th birthday he happened to be there with his wife we went out with them got all fucking sorts of shit housed <laughs> uh met up with a couple of the ladies that are on the active wwe roster and like like you said when you when you look when you're a beautiful woman the door is open to you a lot easier than yeah. when if you know if you look like me yeah, yeah and what a time but i didn't get to do any blow off anybody's asshole though fair enough fair not, enough not even just... not even not even off a clown's boner it was terrible. Jeez, <laughs> come yeah, on so mate you did that right yeah I've never so been who's, to Vegas. Who's never been? All you guys have never been? I've never been. Never been. Oh, never been. Dude, We're we going. gotta go, man. <laughs> I don't know who's better. Reno, California. Ever, yeah. Uh, Reno 911. Yeah. You're 75 <laughs> years old. <laughs> no, Z wants to go to the Bunny Ranch. <laughs> <laughs> Z? Is he still open? I thought he passed uh, away. Rest of ranches I mean, he passed away. Yeah, Dennis Hoff I'd, I'd be dead. surprised. Dennis Hoff is dead, but that legacy still lives. Who's the lady oh, that uh, uh, was always the right hand woman? Sar Sar Madam Suzette. Sergeant Amy. <laughs> yeah, Madam Suzette. Air Force, Air Force Amy. Sergeant Amy. Lieutenant Amy. Madam Suzette ran the joint. Air Force Amy was like the fucking. She was the top earner. Yeah. So she was number one, is what you're saying. She was the first pick. Yeah, she's yeah. the fucking Air Force, baby. All right, next. Nearly half of Americans want Dewey Johnson, yep. The Rock, to run for president. That's not true. That's, what do you mean? It's it hey. right there. It read says it. it's, it's fire. Mitt, read the it. headline, Mitt. Mitt, read it. 
nearly half of the American or half of Americans. <laughs> wow, want Dwayne Johnson to run for president? There is no fucking way that's true. Hey, man, okay, man, we just so said it, man. I'm gonna hit you with some logic right now. I'm gonna hit you with some logic. Yeah. The last president of the United States was a big star on an NBC television show. Oh, How about yeah. that now? What do you think about that, NBC man? star now. And he also wasn't The Rock. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and man, this is a poll, so if we were to go around the room right now and take a straw poll. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, uh, who wants than... The Rock to be president? Yeah. Aye. Aye. Oh, Count aye. Aye. doesn't count, so. Whoa! kind of right. Whoa. Could be naturalized citizen by the time Dwayne's yeah. eligible to run. Yeah. Three years, I can be a fucking citizen. Yeah, now, dude. What's up with, what's up with that, man? Hey. How about See, that, Mitt? There's a right change being made. How about that, Mitt? So I am the only one here that thinks that The Rock is just an absolute corny motherfucker. Whoa. Whoa. Dude. Wow. I mean, like what's politics, This man? generation. Yeah, Mitt, talk to me about his policy. I think Young Rock is corny. I don't think The Rock no. is corny. Yeah, that's right. Have you ever seen him lay the smackdown, dude? Yeah. yeah. How about you shut your candy ass up? <laughs> ever seen the movie The this Rundown, is, this man? Is, this is just Great your movie. generation, man. You ever you seen just, Sean William Scott? You don't about get that. it. You just don't Mitt, get you're going it. off your perception of The Rock based off Young Rock. The, the, Who do you want, Mitt? Fucking Barney? <laughs> um, child? I thought you just not The Rock. <sighs> Tom and Jerry. To Who do you want, that? Fucking I don't know. Someone, I, want, I don't you. care. I want Yosemite Sam to run. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Captain <laughs> Underpants, please. They won't ban my guns. Come on, SpongeBob. Man, you wouldn't want the president of the United States to be six foot five, two hundred and eighty pounds, and just mm -hmm. fucking jacked steel. Yeah, that's why I would and want the that, but not elbow? rock. So who do you him want? Walking into the UN. Dude. Yeah, imagine yeah. imagine any sort of fucking <laughs> some crisis. <laughs> You yeah. Shut up, bitch! That would be yeah. awesome. He walks in, walks cold to the Secretary of Defense. <laughs> yeah. Rock walks into the UN. Finally! <laughs> be uh, awesome. So who do you have, man? Huh? I don't know. Not not the Rock. Can't not a movie say star. Not the rock. Puts yeah, Kim Jong. Jong fucking pick Put somebody. Some puts Kim Jong through a table. Who's oh. beating the Rock in a debate? Correct. Yeah. Nobody. It ain't happening. It's a promo. The, the debate's a promo, man. There's nobody better on the microphone than the Rock. Yeah. Come on, yeah. man. What do you got? Fucking well, Vince just, McMahon, the speaker of the house. True. Yeah, I mean, Vince's cyborg suit should hopefully not be expired by the mm -hmm. point Rock runs. Sure. <laughs> It'll be fun. <laughs> Mate, you gotta come up with a name here, buddy. I don't know anything about politics, so Pick I'm your favorite because we do. I mean, we're talking self. about the Rock yeah. being president. Yeah. I don't think you yeah. know Let, a lot about politics to offer up an Let, alternative here. Let's take politics out the window to the next point. Movie star, Mick, or, or or any sort of celebrity, or any yeah. notable person, who are you picking to run for office? Vin on. fucking Diesel. Oh, all right, that's times cool. out of ten over that's, the rock. That's fair. That's fair. All right, yeah, I can't wait to see that fucking ride in ballot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Vin Diesel, put Dom Toretto up there, please. As electric as Vin would be, I, again, I don't think he's getting past the debate stage. With well, he's also got his no. music career to worry about. Yeah, true. Which he hasn't he, come out with. We're yes. only yeah. sitting with two bangers, dude. We <laughs> need another one. He's waiting on him to Summer's release Summer's on song. deck, dude. <laughs> That's probably what he's waiting for. Imagine the, song the Rock. Summer. True. Imagine the Rock face to face with fucking Kim Jong Un. Yeah, that's oh. what I'm saying. Put him through a table. <sighs> rock bottom, right through fucking the the 33rd parallel. He's fucking in the face. <laughs> fucking tag team match with Rock and Stone Cold versus Kim Jong and Dennis Rodman. <laughs> He's running across the demilitarized zone to deliver the people's elbow. <laughs> oh. He throws his elbow pad into South Korea. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right, next. Good next. Oh, oh thanks, this is sweet. Uh, there's no video to this. It's just a photo. Yeah, just Did a photo. You? There was a lizard in uh, <laughs> Bangkok, Thailand. I'm sure you saw it. It was climbing the. Uh, I don't know what shelf that. Maybe Tums, maybe Head and Cut Shoulders, water? maybe definitely not that. Looks uh, like soups. Soups, perhaps. Uh, and it made the, it to the top. End case. I can't believe things this size. Uh, oh, that's just broth. A bunch of broth. Jeez, that's, that's a Komodo dragon, isn't it? They thought, yeah. Originally, it said Komodo dragon in the video, and then they changed it later in the day to lizard. Yeah, because I don't think they mm. know. Komodo yeah. dragon would would have eaten the entire store. Yeah. No, Komodo Dragons actually have a really good PR team, so they spun it real quick to be really? a lizard. Uh, yeah. I didn't know that. that I mean, that awesome. thing's fucking huge. It's massive. Dude. It looks like a pool float. Yeah. <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> and these people were just casually, like, taking a video of it like nothing was wrong. This well, is what they talk about when they say wanted, Bangkok's got you know. He probably wanted an icy. Look at him. He's just headed to the icy. I'm thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> But that again, so a lot of people did send this to me and said, uh, oh, look at that. You can't beat this thing up. I can whoop the shit out of this thing. No way. Yeah. No chance in hell, Z. Z. 
That thing Come is coming on. at you full speed. What are you doing? We've been able to actually oh, see dude. this. I'll fucking shoot it, dude. It's so low. Okay, yeah. If you got a gun, Z, yeah, I think. No, no, not like shoot it, but like wrestling. Like shoot, like shoot on. Yeah, you know, low that thing is. Low man yeah, wins. Dude. Yeah, exactly. Dude, fucking rip around it. Nah, fucking go yeah. up, dude. Yeah. Look at this. If Just Zeke keep, gets keep those things, low. if Zeke gets those things back, I don't know if its spine yeah. can sustain what is coming. <laughs> so you're saying Cannonball wins? <laughs> yeah, Zeke. Okay. All you got to do I is just get jump. to the back. This dude. could be a Rikishi situation. What if it high legs? <laughs> I would put my butt up. cheeks in that guy's mind. <laughs> <laughs> Eat it! I don't know. One slice. I mean, that is a. Tell me though, you. If obviously the situation is, Tell it's me. not going to be just out of nowhere. You could just kill this thing. But if it's one on one, you're by yourself. You're up with this thing, and all you have to do is get on its back. If I mentally know, like, okay, at this time, you on could this die. Day, I know that I'm going up against it. Yeah. Sure, maybe. But if I'm just walking down the street and this <laughs> thing turns the corner, no, I'm <laughs> fucked. I'm I'm absolutely fucked. Well, you can't run away. It's 45 miles per hour runs or 23 miles. I'm trying to it kick it in the face. face. You can't. That's what climb. I'm saying. Maybe, no but I think then. animals though. Like I watched my dog run straight through a fucking door the other day. That's what I mean. They don't give a shit if stuff happens there but how about my fucking animal instinct bro do you have one yeah what are your animal instincts you fucking sit on it so you, okay so you think just you sit on this brute force sit kills this thing so i do believe short hands short arms so it scratching might get me but mm -hmm. if i get my arm around that fucking neck it's I got it. You're not choking. It it's out, so dude. low to the ground, though. Z. I know. Plus, it's definitely I, strong. It's like, gonna be slippery just, too. If you sat on it, it would just yeah, it's gonna push be a little up. Slimy. It'd be hard to grip that thing. Yeah, dude. I'm telling you, once it gets stuck in the old fucking above the weenus and the other side, I got it. Oh, <laughs> all right, in the meat hook there. Yeah, dude. <laughs> okay, maybe you can choke it out. Either way, that thing's crazy. Next, <laughs> we're fucking poking the eyes. Dude. Question for the fod pod. My lady and I are going to our first all-inclusive in about a month. What's some advice to have the best time and get the best service? I mean, this is easy. We always say this. You tip the, the, tip early. the bartender Threesome. a bunch early, and then you're done. Tip early. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's all that matters. No one cares about anything but fucking cash. Nope. Especially down there. Uh, become, fr uh, become friends with the janitors. The cleaning people, you mean? Oh, yeah. Why, you get extra towels? They're uh, also They, also they fucking know everyone, dude. They don't, what do you mean, Mitt? They're not security. Yeah, dude, I've been chased at an all inclusive before, and it, it is a. Yeah, hey, no, put that like, beer down, kid! When were you at an all inclusive? Chased. Uh, you my for? senior year of high school. Yeah, there you go. Oh, for spring sure. break? Yeah, I was trying to throw a keg that my friend stole. We were trying to throw it into the ocean with a note. Uh, yeah, we were pretty drunk. And then we ended up getting chased around the resort by the security who were also it's just a message the janitors. Keg, dude. So you broke the law, and what you're saying yeah. is. The janitors were the same as the uh, security? They wore the resort security. They were on their, like, golf carts, chasing me down through some paths How and do stuff. you know that they were also janitors? janitors. The cleaning people. Because they, I saw them the next day. I had to walk by them and, like, say hi and stuff. They it sucked. Fucking How'd you get a keys? keg at an all-inclusive in a fucking different country? Yeah. Uh, I jump behind the pool bar at night when it's closed. When it's what? While I like your ingenuity, uh, if you are a smart. normal person on a vacation who just wants to get boozed up at the pool bar, mm -hmm. yeah. just be nice to the people because yeah. most of the people will treat them like shit. So yeah. if you're just nice yeah. to them, they'll love you. Ask for, ask for shots. They love that. Yeah. <laughs> it's an easy game. Good tipping and make it a point to know Their name. the people's names. Yep. Exactly. That goes such a fucking long way, man. Yep. Mm. <sighs> okay. That's good advice. Mm -hmm. The name. I didn't think of that. Don't be afraid to shake a hand. Don't shake be afraid to shake it. Well, it is COVID. Actually, don't shake a hand. Yeah, probably, probably not. Probably only, that, but. only fist, fist bumps. Because uh, uh, every once in a while, when you shake a hand, you're gonna get a bag of coke in it, and then you're not sure what to do with it. And then you gotta dump it down the drain, or in Mitt's case, you know. And then there's a clown. Do it. Do whatever's next. Okay, <laughs> next. The clown. All right, you have to lose three forever in any future projects, and I'm gonna actually add this, including you've never seen it before if you delete it. Star Wars, Marvel, DC, Jurassic Park, Harry Potter, Lord of the Rings, Fast and Furious, Mitt, Back to the Future, 007, Star Trek, Indiana Jones, Avatar. It's pretty easy, right? Fucking Back to the Future, mm. Star Trek, and Indiana Jones can mm. kick rocks. Tony. No, Indiana Tony. Jones is a classic. Indiana Jones, you scum. Back to the Future. What's wrong with you, dude? Back I've never to the future, even yeah, seen Harry Potter. Grow up, dude. I mean, all right, I'll do fuck. No, Indiana, no. 
The disrespect towards I mean, fucking Doc Brown and Marty McFly too. Star, really Star Trek, stinks, get the hell dude. out of my face. I think That's I think true. we're all in agreement. Star Trek, Star Trek, out. Out. Star Trek, so DC, out. out the fucking door for but, me. But they may do something cool in the future. Nah, there's a lot of time. They, it, the Marvel so far ahead that they have to fucking like do like a massive sprint in the next. What two if Chris Nolan wants to do more Batman movies? That's that was my biggest thing. He doesn't. I forgot but about DC I say having what Batman. If, those are the only saving grace from DC. There's those, the, the Joker, yeah. and. Yeah. I like Shazam. But Black Adam's going to be sweet. I you like can Shazam get rid too. of six of these, in my opinion. Whoa. Gump, dude. Dude, yeah. which ones? All, all, all I Potter. need is Fast and Furious, mm -hmm. yeah. oh, 007, yeah. Oh, yeah. Indiana Jones, okay. Avatar, yes. Yeah. Yes. Back to the Future, okay. yeah. and I Jurassic Park. I've never okay. watched any of the other ones, any of them. I mean, I could, Marvel out. <laughs> I could do without Star Wars. I love oh, the Star Wars no. movies, but I could do without them. Wow. Reminds me, tonight I think I'm going to dive into... Episode three and episode four, maybe it's been. Ooh. I've been gone of uh, Falcon, Winter Soldier, Hawk. Episode three was the best one yet. Okay, yeah, cool. So good. I've only seen the first half of the second that one. That guy's face in the mask fucking stinks, dude. Yeah, it just does. Wait. But he does some sweet shit. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Okay. What's your favorite out like of him. all these? My favorite? I'd probably say, uh, oof. I think Marvel just I, took I'm it over. I'm going Marvel game. or 007. Dun -dun -dun -dun. I'm. Yeah. Going Lord the newer of the 007 movies are just not that good. As I know, but like I still sucks. love watching the old ones with Connery. No, for sure, yeah. Look Probably at me right Marvel. now, Money Penny. Want to undo that bowl and get to know you? <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Next, Fod, you're a contract killer slash assassin. What is your first assignment? How much are you being paid? A trillion dollars, and how do you see the job playing out? Success. Well, if number one and two, I, I have no way of knowing those things. I'm a contract killer. I don't choose my assignments. They're given to me. Yeah, they choose you. And yeah. there is a bounty on the person's head, uh, so I don't know. Does this guy not know anything remember about the, Remember the and contract it's... killer from Faster? Faster? No. Have you never seen Faster? No. What's it on? With The Rock and Billy Bob Thornton? I'm going to say I have no idea. Oh, so, do two yourself guns has been a, on a favor, lot dude. I Faster, love two huh? guns. It's on Netflix, I think, two and is Amazon. Awesome. Is that Jeff Passan that sent that question? <laughs> I don't know, but it was at 1230. Is this guy a contract killer who sent this? He's in a suit. Maybe. Oh, he blurred his own face. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> Mitt, Mitt, you like I don't know, but I can tell you that I'm most likely going to use a silencer or fucking strangling wire. Down Bicycle. Down. Well, yeah, I mean, if you want to. Fucking poison. Climate permitting, of course. Yeah. It's true. See you later. We know poison you. guy. Hey, here's a drink. The coward's weapon. Gotcha. Goodbye. Smart weapon. <laughs> dude, I don't know, dude. I feel like uh, the weapon in 007, uh, The World Ends Tomorrow, that big laser from the sky. Mm -hmm. Can you imagine if that just came down like that guy's dead and we don't Excuse know what happened? Let's die another day. Really? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but. Man, sir. Yeah, the Icarus laser. I could see that. I could see what you're going with. Yeah. Okay. Destroy them. Destroy them. Maybe not. Them. Send a missile from your submarine, maybe. That's probably what I'd do. Because I live in a submarine. If I think I it's meant to be a little more low-key. That's what I'm saying. But nah. my contract killing is fucking high-key. <laughs> <laughs> Get his uh, ass. <laughs> Next. You're fishing with dynamite. I see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, the streaming future of the oh, Marvel Spider-Man is on Netflix. After 22... <laughs> after 2022, any Spider-Man movies will be streaming exclusively wow. on Netflix after their theatrical runs. Does this mean Spider-Man's dead after these next few hey, movies? Look who it is. Spider Z. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it's just surprising with Disney Plus that they're. That's what I mean. Letting Netflix take this. Are they doing that because they're he? Well, they, they were. They, they were some something. sort of weird yeah. deal, didn't they? Because didn't Sony have the rights to Spider-Man? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And then they were going to cancel it, and then yeah, there they, was a petition. They basically. found some sort of fucking, you know, compromise to make it happen. And now it's a long way home. But if they're saying after 2022, does that mean there's one this year, one next year? Spider-Man might be dead. Wait, Maybe. is it Spider-Verse on Netflix or on Disney Plus? Uh, it was on Netflix. Disney Plus now, I think, though. But it might be oh, on okay. Disney Plus now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So that wouldn't make any sense for this. Far From Home, also on Disney Plus. But that's what I mean. Like, if they're letting... Some like the new movies go on to Netflix after they come out, then how does that mean Disney Plus is a thing, Zeet? Mm. That's fucking insane. I keep looking at Spider Man's Zeet, though. Spider Man's <laughs> dead. Sp Spider Man's dead. Just a prediction here. Next. I mean, none of the other ones made it past three. Exactly. And plus, this you is got the third think one. Good for God, them, Spider too. Tom's so young. Probably He's the best new of them shit. All. 
I like Tom, Tom Holland. Holland. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's doing a. Uh, he did that movie Cherry on Apple Plus. Is it good? No, I never never watched it. Think it looked good, <laughs> but he's also doing a show on Apple Plus now. He's starting. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Is there anything Apple Plus, on man? Apple Plus? They have yeah. see all their stuff is good. It's just there's fucking, only one uh, season because it just there's they, a murder yeah, mystery got, podcasting yeah. on there. I fucking love it. Morning dude. show was good. They've morning got another show. season of morning show. They're in production right now. Yeah. I liked C. Oh, I was yeah, preaching C was good because it starts a little slow, but once you get into it, you're like, oh, okay. Let's see. Defending uh, Jacob, fucking good. Momoa, bro. Defending Momoa. Jacob, the fuck. I mean, I'm not spoiling it, but god damn it, that ending. Yeah, I'll get you. Fuck. Yeah, I don't think there there's also a too. show that I know you guys won't like it, but it's a video game creator, but it's this guy from uh, Always Sunny. Uh, I can't I remember his Mac. Name. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I Mac saw that. And he's like a video game creator. And it's very, very corny. It's like, uh, what's the HBO show? It's Silicon Valley. It's like, it's that, oh, but yeah. just video games. Okay. I might ch check that out. You didn't like Defending Jacob, Gumpy? I loved it. I just, the ending, the ending was just left me... Uh, Wanting more. Yeah, apparently for uh, All Mankind, the uh, astronaut show they have on there, apparently that's pretty good. Haven't seen that. And obviously Is that Sandra Bullock? Ted Lasso. Uh, no, I don't think Sandra Bullock's in that. I saw uh, a uh, preview with um, Angelina Jolie yesterday, I believe. Really? Mm -hmm. uh, it was her birthday. I think that was just like a cameo. No, thing. no, they're coming out with something. I can't remember what it's called. On but... Apple Plus? Nah, not on Apple Plus. Oh, sorry. Bill Murray did a movie on Apple Plus. Did he? Yeah. I can't remember what it's called or anything about it, but I know Bill Murray's in oh. a movie on Apple Plus. The astronaut show is also about uh, Russians getting. To I know what you're talking about. I can't. I can't. I just can't think of the title of it. But I can like see like scenes from like the little trailer. Uh, I, I Google it. It just says "On the Rocks." On the Rocks. That's the movie. I couldn't tell you. That's the thing that popped up though. Go on. Now we go. Go on. Back to contract killers, real quick. I was reading something <laughs> earlier this week. Uh, I can't remember what network is doing it, but there is a spinoff in development of John Wick. They're doing a spinoff of the Continental. Uh, the hotel in New York City. Really, yeah. I like that. Huh. That's that's a whole world you could explore. Oh Pretty yeah, fucking sweet. Those I want one of those coins. That just gets you in anywhere. Yeah. Oh yeah. Back to Falcon and Winter Soldier. The guy who uh, created John Wick, I think, directed that yeah. third episode. Is that Baba Yaga. Oh, is that why so many murder Baba and killings Yaga. would happen? Yeah, that's why it's all juiced up with the action. That's why it's the best one yet. Let's go. Now we go. All right, next. Pop out question. Uh, I feel like I know you all, but if you guys could host your own podcast with your own co-host, who would they be and why? Also, what would be the title? Uh, Morning Wood. Fucking Hammer Don Gumpy. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Paul. Yeah, I feel like we do that. Or <laughs> yeah. 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 Nick, yeah. you should do a show Good about question. hockey. That's not a bad oh, idea. Yeah. Wow. Call it that's hockey. You should do a wrestling one, man, sir. Shit, it would be the best wrestling show, period, if we ever did it. <laughs> <laughs> Mitt, you have one, don't you? Nah, I don't have a co-host. What was That'd that? Sweet. Shitty, What's it called, what's though? It called? I, I did a Mitt Fucking Stories one time. I had a funny story. Story, story time with Mitt. I like yeah. it. You I should like do it. the keg story, dude. Mitt the bookmaker, dude. Yeah, the keg story, Mitt. Yeah, or talk about your big, juicy milkmaid <gasps> you sucking on those ghost <gasps> ah, that's right. Night. Whole fucking wet nurse at Mitt's yeah. house. Not wet nurse. Fucking scary old nurse who <laughs> has <laughs> very, very saggy bags. Whoa! Jeez. She had big boobs. Holy bulls, huh? shit! Oh, was that dude. the first boob you ever saw? No, that was she, not. I was like nineteen, twenty. She rolled up her pant leg, oh, and you saw her titty coming out of her. That's awesome. But hey, yeah, subscribe to all the YouTubes now that we're here. All yeah. those have YouTube. Hit those YouTubes, man. Them. Yeah, Morning Wood will be starting soon. Morning Wood will be up there. Out. Next. Uh, the guy who played Spider in School of Rock, the dude who uh, ends up <laughs> making out with the principal at the end of the movie, is now the district attorney of Tyler County, Texas. And now we're all going to just have to live with that information forever. Yeah, this is pretty wild. DAs are real, too. Like, they... They do real justice. Yeah, <laughs> Harvey Dent. Don't they do, like, all the cases yeah. that are uh, yeah. the state yeah. against yeah. whoever? Does he have those actual tattoos? I don't yeah. know. Oh, yeah. Does yeah, he, he shows those, up the court rocking that does outfit. Does he still have oh. those V penis lines is what I'm a, <laughs> I want to know. Yeah, I want to see him show up to fucking try a case dressed like Shawn Michaels. <laughs> that's, that's sweet, dude. <laughs> yeah. District Attorney, no joke, dude. Speaking of defending Jacob, that's like who Chris Evans is in yeah. that movie. So he's like, ah, uh, fucking acting didn't work out. I'm going to go be a DA. And apparently he's crushing it, too. DA got the dope. That's sweet. Mate, you ever seen School of Rock? Oh, uh, yeah, I have. I'm Not just, that good. Just making sure. Oh, oh, yeah, it's this guy's problem. What's this guy's deal, man? 
Jesus. I don't really like so corny movies, dude. dude. I thought it was kind of so corny. corny about that? Why are you, Jack Black's you corny. Are? Ned Sneedley. Yeah, it's what? for fucking younger people, man. Like, just enjoy it. You like cartoons. Yeah, that's corny, man. No, cartoons are not corny. They're just mindless entertainment. Damn you! What's wrong with grade schoolers forming a band this and winning guy a fucking gets contest? Fucking worse I mean, every come on. show. Wait, so you hate heavyweights too? No, heavyweights is hilarious. I love those you. fat kids. Oh, you're back in. Oh, you didn't have to shame them. Uh, yeah, I mean that's. No, I'm not. I'm not shaming them. I said I love them. It's classic. Oh, you're back in. Oh, you're back, back in. You named them. All right, next. Uh, what's a food slash snack from a TV show or cartoon you always Good wanted question. to try? Fuck Krabby man. Patty. Mm. Oh. I always wanted to try an ice cold duff from The Simpsons. No. I've always wanted to try a crusty burger. Oh, okay. yeah. El pollo hermanos. Okay. <laughs> Taggarty oh. Farms. Taggarty. They actually did have a pop up store for their curly fries. I think it was in New York. Was it good? I wasn't there. Son of a bitch. They had like all the dipping sauces, like how they had like in the, the last couple episodes. Yeah. What about when Mo, Mo opened his restaurant? And Simpsons. Mo's family feedback. I'd rather go for the flame and Mo. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Homer. Mo. What restaurant Mo. did fucking uh, Mo. Um, Artie Bucco on? Uh, uh, Vesuvio. Yeah, I want to eat at Vesuvio. At Universal, you can uh, go and have the Duff beer and go and drink at Mo's or whatever, like the little recreation version. I did see that. I'd like yeah. to try that. I'm surprised yeah. you didn't go with a uh, butterbeer stooge. I've already had oh. butterbeer. That's why. So good. Sorry, you know. Had one at the uh, Universal. How good was that? I bet it was delicious. <laughs> it was an orange soda. So if you ever want a butterbeer, go ahead. No, it. no it's not. Did you the one? Uh, I think so. It's yeah. like it's butter. It's butterscotch over fucking ice. It's delicious. Yeah, yeah. It's like delicious. an orange, like an orange cream soda. Nah, Those two things taste nothing at like. Yeah, cream skull and butterscotch is the same thing. No, it doesn't taste like beer. And Connor, yeah, you have not definitely beer. not had it if you think it tastes like orange soda. Cream soda is what I meant. From yeah, the get-go, yeah, yeah, I was okay. wrong okay. on orange soda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's yeah, cream yeah. soda. Cheesy Poofs from South Park. Oh. Okay. Oh, cheesy. Uh, I'm looking at a couple articles. Uh, the Goofy movie, the pizza they're eating. Yeah, well, yeah we've, we've pizza. seen that. That's been on here. Yeah, get a, get a frozen banana from Arrested Development. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's always money in the banana mm -hmm. stand. That's true. A Bob's Burger. You know. Oh, uh, the sushi from uh, the Pokemon game N64 back in the day, where the licky tongue is licking all the. Never mind. Uh, <laughs> I'm not trying. that sushi. <laughs> The place where Kim Possible works with her, uh, with that dude, and that the burgers that you they just serve. want to eat. That oh, uh, the spaghetti from Whoa. Lady the Tramp. <laughs> What about, the, what about the pizza that the Ninja Turtles always had? The cheese always looked so perfect. The mom, the also mom. Delicious. <laughs> also delicious. Next. <laughs> what is one tip slash trick you have learned from a roommate? Hmm. One of my roommates used to uh, tape a cup next to his bed to put his phone in. And I was like, that's actually pretty genius. I'm going to start doing that. And that's what I did. What was the purpose? So you can, like, hang it there while it was charging because there's no nightstand. <laughs> Just get a nightstand. Shut up, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking sick, dude. It was awesome. And it worked. Um, I mean, now I do have a nightstand. But I'm just saying that was a tip and a trick. I think. I never really, I never really got a tip or trick. Yeah, I feel like I was always the one giving out the tips, and tricks. Just a bunch of teachers in here. Uh, yeah. That's why, you know. Shout out to you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, shout out. Shout, shout out, out to us. Wow. Good work, boys. Next. Uh, Outcast recently shared tweets saying rap is better than the Beatles leads to debate. Yeah, there's a massive debate going on right now that Outcast is better than the Beatles. I don't know how we all feel about this. I personally stand on the Beatles side. I do too. Oh, shit. Yeah, as do I. Outcast was hardly okay. the the best rap group of the '90s. No, but they were pretty fucking good. They were, they, they, were, they, they were awesome. I can't point with the Beatles, but they're pretty fucking good. Yeah, I mean, Beatles changed. Music. Changed music. People are going to bat for Outcast. Though. We were transcendent. Yeah. Well, I'm sure. Mitt I mean, you can make the argument though that Outcast changed the rap game. Yeah. They weren't doing the gangster game. thing. You know? They were out there. Yeah. No, you got to bank up. Don't stand but Live a little bit, bit, bit of juice. And they put they each put out solo albums. Yeah. They had two fucking huge smash Speaker hits. Speaker box love below. Yeah. I mean no. People no one's saying no one say the outcast wasn't great. No. Do they have a bad breakup or is that just no, I think they no, just kind of... They just went their separate yeah. ways. Yeah, I think they just got involved. Like, Andre started acting a lot more. Yeah, Big Boy started producing a lot more. Yeah. Yeah. But the Beatles did have a bad breakup, so does that go into... They did. Does that go into... I mean, the Beatles is the Beatles. 
Yeah. Beatles, Beatles is, is the Beatles. Beatles. Cro- I would never look at a crosswalk the same. Never. But hey, you never know. Paul, Ma- Paul McCartney might be hitting some fucking Rosa Parks at a at a karaoke spot. True. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Everybody move mm. to the back of the bus. Fucking uh, uh, a, a banger that has overlooked Rosa Parks. Hell of a fucking track. Yes. Yeah. Remember when there was all the remixes of it? When Napster like first started going, you could get remixes with any beat. You used to get like uh, DMX. Oh, fuck. Probably Pitbull. Boop, 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 but boop. Hey Ya uh, had like every other beat behind it. Yeah. Rosa Parks was the same. Rosa Parks with like, uh, I forget what the DMX beat behind was it, it was. Was it Stop Being Greedy? Uh, I can't remember, man. May have been Stop Being Greedy. A lot of remixes there. But Beatles overall is what we're saying. Yeah. Overall, the Beatles. Okay. Oops. I can't even. I can't even say Outcast on this one. Whoa! Not That's even good. you. Look no. at you. And I actually like the only li- music I'll really listen to is like rap music, hip hop music, and I actually love the Beatles. Yeah, like, I'm you're like, a child. Yo, submarine, am I right? Yeah. Oh man, we all live there. In the time it was born. Next banger. I just got an email. What you guys think about um, Red Bulls? <laughs> Bread what? Bowls? What's your thoughts on bread bowls? Bread, bread bowls? bowls? Yeah, I love bread Big bowls. Fan. Pretty good. Yeah, like from Domino's. From anything, just uh, like Panera. I uh, see. I love a good Panera, like a good soup in there. Whew. You can't take that to go, though, right? You can't take a bread bowl to go. Nah, it doesn't travel well. They give you, uh, they give you the soup in a plastic container, oh, and, and then, then they you... give you the bread bowl, and you ah, you self like assemble Panera. when you get home. That's really I like cool. Panera, but I do have questions about it, especially after that one viral video of them just taking out. Mac and cheese in a frozen bag and cooking it. Uh-huh. Oh yeah. I didn't like it after that. What do you mean? You think everything's fresh? I would hope. It's supposed that's, to be. Is, that's their thing. That's Panera fresh. There's nothing fresh about fast food. Yeah, but Panera pitches that they're fresh and their it's bread's good. always fresh. I'm gonna tell you something fast, too. Fucking dude. like Pizza Hut, that's frozen, baby. Oh well, I know that. that, okay. that I know that. That's different. Not the wings, dude. The, the frozen. Wendy's no. isn't frozen. You yeah. think they're cooking the chicken head? It's good food fast, dude. Yeah, Wendy's isn't frozen. Sorry, I'd, sorry to take us off. Arby's is off frozen. Topic here. No, 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 no. no. Oh, no I'm just messing around. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think the top part of a mermaid also tastes like fish or that it would actually be red meat? <laughs> would there be a solid line where the meat changes in their body or would it kind of blend? Could you make a surf and turf platter with one mermaid carcass? I like where this person's at right now. <laughs> this blew my mind. Yeah, I was trying to figure it out. I don't know. I, I'm going on the middle one that it just, there's a solid line. It just splits. And I think there's fish. a solid line. Yeah. Too. yeah. Hannibal one. Lecter writes... <laughs> yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. This is cannibalism. The bottom portion is fish. Wouldn't it all have to be that? Because uh, isn't it like a cold-blooded thing? Yeah, cold-blooded, warm-blooded. Because you're living in the water. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I'm, I'm just I'm I spitballing know. here. Just trying to think. Plus, where are the gills on a mermaid? I was just thinking the same thing. Oh. I think it's boobs. on the hips. Under the boobs. Under the hips, don't boobs. Okay. Or behind the ears sometimes. Behind the ears. The boobs. I've seen it on the neck too. What's that old movie where like or it's like a thousand years in the future and then every the whole world's underwater? Waterworld. Kevin Costner. Oh, Absolute oh, classic. Great movie. Yes. yes. That Great was movie. the uh, that most movie. amount of money spent on a movie for a very long time. Oh. Yeah. Sometimes mermaids have one set of eyelids and then they blink a completely separate set of eyelids. Yeah, they have two eyes like frogs. Mm-hmm. Or when uh, that Will Black? Smith tracked down that sepulpoid <laughs> yeah. on foot. Uh huh. Got remember. him a job as K. Nope, K was Tommy Lee. But he got Jay. him a job. He Jay. was Jay. Yeah. But tracking, no, this is a hundred. Tracked him true. down on foot. This is surf and turf. I would. Yeah, like, I, I, I don't one. think the tail though of the mermaid. That's a good sample. Is going to be a good portion of the mermaid to eat. So I think it's going to be a lot of little bones. Yeah. Like you got to uh, peel off the shit vein. Yeah, mm-hmm. the shit, the poop vein. And you got to peel off the scales. A lot of. So maybe go for the. Uh, That's actually a great question. Where that? Where's the mermaid poop from? From her. From her. From her we're butt. all fishies from poop. Butt vagina. Yeah. A little squiggly line just, just like, falls out while they're swimming. Yeah. yeah. Like that. So you're telling me that fucking guy was going in there? Oh yeah. What guy? Aquaman. No, hey, man. Uh, John Smith. John. No, that's Pocahontas. You're talking about Kevin Costner. No, Little Mermaid. Talk about Prince Eric. Prince Eric. Prince Eric. Well, Ariel had legs when she was on land. Yeah, she turned uh, human. Then she went back. Yeah, and then, where is it? <laughs> Next. <laughs> <laughs> if time is money in an ATM, then consider it a time machine. Maybe that is why it's called an ATM because ATM could secretly stand for a time machine. No, I always get money. I can't go back in time. And plus, then the money's gone. Yeah. But why is it ATM? An ATM. 
Automatic teller machine, right? Is that what it is? Oh, I think it stands for a time machine, Mike. <laughs> Check so you think instead of pushing your pin, your pin, you should just push in the date or you know specific point in time you want to go to. Are we living in the year? Whoa! I mean, time is not really money. Time's a construct, boys. Yeah. Exactly. Time True. is a flat circle. Made up. It's all relative. This uh, is deep. I like this. This is good. Yeah, think about it. Fucking Einstein said that. Next, if you fold the paper in but half. But if you could time travel, you could get money. Next. You're there. Did Dumpy just oh, fucking? Are you talking about next? Inception? Yeah, and we're at that time. That's it. We've we're reached at that time. All right. We're at that time. Well, we got to say bye to YouTube. Bye. Just bye like YouTube. to start. Bye. And some props. See you, YouTube. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>